Hey everybody, it's Yang Antonio here with another episode of Thomas Was Alone. We left off with the maze. Over water, eh? newly heightened senses told her that there were multiple paths across with various possible configurations of the little posse. Alright, so yeah, we left off in the little checkpoint, but you know, fuck it. We'll get there. Ooh. Them skills. I didn't get affected by that. And we are gonna need Claire. John can make it on his own. Ooh. <laughs> You're slacking, John. You're slacking, John. God damn it, John, you're slicking! Alright, that was my fault. Oh, uh, go! Oh my god, John! Oh! Alright, Claire needs to move. There you go, Claire. <sighs> John, you were on the top of your game. Oh, never mind. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's go. They were doing really well. Claire hoped she could get them all across. John was fully aware he could do this alone. Of course. Hope she'd never have to. John is a dick. Oh, oh. I'm sorry, chaps. See it, Thomas. Thomas can make it. I believe in. I believe in him. Um, how about we get Claire to go help you? Come on, precious. Ooh, she climbed on that. There you go. Oh God damn it! Yes, finally. Thank you. There you go. Oh. Yay! Oh, what's going on here? Looks like a trap. It's a trap! What the fuck? There's spikes. She needed to be where there were rectangles to save. Being the only superhero in a given space kind of defeats the object. Spikes? It was new. Claire avoided them. She decided they were most likely her kryptonite. Not the rubbish red kryptonite, the proper radioactive green stuff. Oh. Oh. Come on, precious. Precious, you little bitch. You need to be slim like Chris. There we go. Perfect. Oh, Get that perfect jump. Yay. Uh oh. She with Thomas? Yeah, she with Thomas. Look at her being all happy. I'm sorry. The world was repeating. And this time Thomas was here. Claire felt something had gone wrong. There was a disturbance in the force. Uh I'm pretty sure you're gonna get sued for that. The world was reacting to their progress. It was amassing its forces. <laughs> Plotting against them. It's Chris's fault. Finally had a nemesis. Man, you're saying like you're proud of it, shit. Here you are. You see, you died because of this guy. Oh, should have moved. That was my fault. God damn it! Jump. Ooh, them skills. 
Well, he can wait. We need to get Big Bus over here. Big Bus don't like it. Ooh. I wonder. Nope. Thomas, you suck. Yep, there we go. There we go. <laughs> Thomas, you were, um... I had my doubts. You have to make me proud. Everyone else failed me. There's the evil villain after all. Let's not make the mistake again, Thomas. Ooh, let's let's do this. <laughs> hey. Hup. In my mind it was a three sixty, I just couldn't see it. Ooh, what's going on here? Achievement unlock, huge success. Hmm. What's going on here? Ooh. Is this a new person? Yes it is. New music. Well. Laura was pleased this one was behind the wall. Maybe he'd never know what she could do. Maybe, maybe they could just have a conversation, huh? hang out. Bitch, what you mean, hang out? He didn't find out what she could do, which would never happen so long as they stayed separate. It's like divorce marriages or marriages that don't work, they're all separate rooms and shit. Or like a curtain. You know who you are. Laura didn't have time to worry about the ominous pixel cloud. It had been following her for some time, and it had kept itself to itself until now. Oh! More important. As the square, who had shyly introduced himself as Chris, bounced atop Laura, she began to worry that he was just using her like all the others had. They'd all bounced too, and then they disappeared when her back was turned. Like people today in relationships, one-sided relationships. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Only the ominous pixel cloud ever remained, looking a little bigger and a little less hungry with every disappearing friend. Hmm. Bounce, Laura found herself less and less irritated by Chris. She started to miss him when he wasn't there. On another platform or something. What a bitch. Make up your mind. Oh, he can make it. No, he can't. Come on, Laura. Jump! There you go, Laura. She'd wonder what he was up to. Was he missing her? You'll need a wonder. He wasn't saying very much. God damn it, you fat sack of shit. No, Laura. what you want about Chris, but you can make it. Chris was in love. She was oh, shit. perfect. He had to tell her so. 
At some point, he would definitely tell her. Probably best to wait for a moment the large, ominous pixel cloud wasn't about there. Yeah, probably best to wait. Huh. More like a pussy. God damn it, Chris. Ooh. Gotta be careful not to move so fast. Slow and steady does not win the ways, but it makes it perfect. We're almost there. Come on. You fall, I swear to God, I'm a rage quit. No, I don't rage quit. But still, I'll do something. I wonder how she keeps like up there. Oh fuck! Oh my god! <laughs> Poor Chris. There you go. You don't need her, Chris. You can make it. Yay! Like playing Pong. Ooh, everyone's here. Yeah, it's a party. Or a foursome. Whatever. Chris was massively disappointed to run into the gang again. Well, he'd enjoyed the alone time with his new girlfriend. What a bitch. Man, we're just here to hang out and have fun. But no, Chris wants to be a little hard ass. He's like, get off my girl. <laughs> you could say they're pounding her. Nope. Only if I say it out loud, he told himself. He didn't want to scare her off. Oh, you're going to scare her off. Don't worry. They don't like it when you do that. Ah, oh, don't tell me. Oh, well, this is a job for John. Good job, John. He doesn't need to be on him anymore because of his new girlfriend. The others seem suspicious of Laura and the eager looking pixel cloud of death which seemed to be watching her. I would sure, be they too. They used her inherent bounciness to reach slightly higher jump points, but they wouldn't strike up a conversation with her. Chris found them rude. You, sir, are rude. Rude? And always there. Well, anyways. I guess this will be a good place to end the episode. Like a favor, if you enjoyed, that will really help me a lot, and we will stay tuned for more Thomas Stallone.